Good afternoon, everyone. My name is ZM Wise, and I'm bringing you, the viewers out there, another home recording. This poem was published in the winter issue of Harbinger Asylum, 2012, and you'll like this especially if you're into existentialism. It's called I Am What to You. I am what to you? I am nightshade, a shadow of ebony whispers. I am the winter that blesses you with three months of Antarctic bliss. I am a dunce for loving someone like you. I am your rebirth, providing a second chance at this game you call life. I am nirvana, my state beats your other fifty hands down. I am the electricity that is placed in every meaningful kiss. I am a creation for poets and poetesses alike. I am your alter ego, viewing the world through your eyes and spirit. I am time, ticking away and running out every waking moment. I am the decoy that the government's plot holes sent to keep you sane and arranged. I am a garden one of several compliments from Mama Terra. I am your doppelganger, though I am quite befuddled in the haunting process while you are still alive. I am space, infinite, gaseous, and peaceful. I am the erect member that penetrates the moist counterpart softly and forms a spiritual connection with her blushing face. I am a romantic, hopelessly in love with everything heart-shaped. I am your scythe, your only grim means of protection and parking spot in Tartarus. I am bliss, for if you caress me, rainbow visions await you ahead. I am the omnipresent one, taking up collective places, seeing all and being everywhere. I am a corridor, lonesome, Dylan-esque, and limited. I am your subway system, passing through with a modern version of Charon the ferryman. I am poetry, defining the senses of self-induced words. I am the peace, upside down, mirror reflection of violence and profane chaos. I am a page, turning life and exhaling numb attempts. I am your only hope your only conclusion, and your only emancipation to contentment. I. Am. You.